Hi, for today's Tierdan, we have this uh, little black box from uh, Sperry Gyroscope Company. It is the slaving amplifier type C uh, with an uh, English part number. Not sure how old it is, it must be from the beginning of the 70s. Serial number seems to be 470 and here we have a tag saying it was repaired in uh, 1979 <coughs> with uh, another number here it is not the serial number obviously maybe a, a repair order number or something like this so it is a black box with golden connector here. I have seen, I believe, photos on eBay. It is part of a big rack with several of these boxes, apparently to control the um, gyroscope in the aircraft. So as you can see, we have two screws on the top which are soldered in place. And it looks like we have, excuse me, a band of metal here which is uh, soldered in place also so I will try to pry it open it was 2 euros on the British eBay so not a big deal I try to figure out how to proceed ah, actually it is just a sticky tape no, it is not anymore soldered so it is good because first it will be probably easier to replace and it will be easier to open some glue that I will be able to remove after it. Okay, not a big deal. And now I am annoyed with the two screws here at the top. So let me first try to just unscrew them like, like so. Of course, it is not the correct size screwdriver. It is never the correct size screwdriver. Maybe this one. Oh, yes. Easy enough. It is turning. So not sure what they did use here, but it is not, uh, it is some kind of glue it seems, but it is not uh, actually soldered in place. So it is good. I have just uh, one screw remaining. And we should be able to have a look inside this thing. Actually I am very curious to know what there is inside. And as you can see, no shooting here, I did not open it previously. So, are you ready for the reveal? Okay. So the box is just the box. And here is what we have. Uh, no circuit boards, but uh, point to point uh, boards here with uh, Teflon insulators. Apparently a very old school parts. Here we have a circuit board. Ferranti branded box here. And here is the other side. So I did not tie. So where is it? Yes, here it seems they did remove a part. A capacitor obviously. It is written. See. 24, so it is missing a capacitor. This one is a little bit low, so they did remove a big one here and they did not replace it. So what do we have else? Yes, here it is mostly uh, resistors, capacitors. Uh, maybe a diode here. Well, at least a two legs a polarized device. Here we might have a transistor. Uh, there is this box here written 
Might be some kind of a little uh, toroidal transformer, I guess. More capacitors here. Very old school design, this one. On the circuit board, we have a fairly uh, common German made Wima capacitor. This is not a military grade uh, part or uh, aircraft grade. This is a common uh, type of uh, 70s era capacitor, I believe. I had actually one I remember in a controller for a toy train I had when I was uh, young and uh, some uh, cover was uh, possible to undo and there was, uh, I remember, a capacitor like so in this. So, uh, did bug mounted transistor here. The Ferranti box, maybe a magnetic uh, something controller for uh, gyroscope, for synchro, controlling of synchro resolvers or something like this. Seems to be a potted box with uh, 10 contacts. A lot of unpopulated spa piece here. Uh, serial number is written again here, so 470. And it is actually all. Okay, quite nicely made. Obviously, it has been uh, repaired. I can see the solder work here is uh, obviously not original. This capacitor is not uh, attached with uh, glue. It is flying around in the breeze. The other ones are fairly well uh, attached. This one has a brand of Erie Untalic, it seems. <coughs> 15 microfarads, 70 volts. And here we have an interesting little device with uh, enameled wires coming from it. And might be a little UTC something, I guess it may be a little relay. Interesting. Maybe there is another one here actually. The same kind of uh, connections at least. And it is all. <coughs> so, quite a little uh, box, but interesting. And it was just two heroes anyway. So, now I have just to uh, put it back together and find probably some uh, black electrician tape to wrap around. So, Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.